the snow came off and I tried to swerve and it went right through the passenger side window. This was frightening. A chunk of ice flies off a tractor trailer, crashing into a car, injuring a six year old girl in the back seat. And tonight, investigators want to find that truck driver who witnesses say never even slowed down. As Christina Rex shows us, the little girl is sporting a few scrapes, and her mom is thankful that it wasn't much worse. Both mom and daughter are safe and sound at home in Woburn tonight. Grateful that the injuries in this case were only minor. You can see by their absolutely smashed through front window of their car, this situation could have ended much worse. It could have killed her, could have killed me, could have killed anybody. A terrifying experience for any mother. Smashed the windshield and injured the a six year old in there. Leading Amanda Grenier to hold her six year old Avery a little tighter. She has no glass in her eyes. She was a trooper. Mom Amanda was in the front seat, Avery in a booster seat in the back, as they drove along 495 North in Andover Thursday afternoon, when a large piece of ice flew off an 18-wheeler and threw their windshield. And I was beeping like crazy, trying to get the guy's attention. The guy looked at my car. He seen I was going crazy beeping, and he kept driving. The family was running errands, buying Valentine's Day presents, when Avery's face was cut and bruised by the ice. Good. Avery says she feels okay after being treated at the hospital. Now the car sits in a tow lot. The front windshield shattered, shards of glass and ice on the front seats and car seat. Amanda says there's an important lesson to be learned from her close call. Yeah, clean off your snow. If cars have to do it, 18 wheelers have to do it. And a witness to the accident actually did get the license plate number of that tractor trailer and gave it to police. They say they're still investigating. In Lawrence, Christina Rex, WBZ News.